Dear civil engineers, welcome back to School of Civil Engineering. If you hear, that means you are facing a problem in, in a state RCDC, okay? A problem like minimum 13 stations are required for beam. So when we are trying to design our beam from ETAPS, okay? Uh, I mean from our ETAPS design and analysis, then maybe we are facing that problem in a state or cdc that's why uh, and I, i'm just going to show that how we'll solve that problem so to solve that problem first of all i'll close that software okay and i'll just go to etaps i'll just go to etaps uh, where i have just designed my where i have analysis my frame okay or my structure and I'll just open that file from here. So this is my file, what I'm using actually. So just see, uh, when you hear, what you have to do actually, you have to define 13 output station. Okay, you have to define 13 output station. So how we will define, we'll just go select, then select and the object type are uh, properties what I'll do frame section and we have to select all of the beam okay we have to select all of the beam so I have two types of beam I have selected and I'll click select then close so see all of beam I have selected so if I just go in 3d view just see all of that file here all of that file are selected okay so um, I mean all of our beam have selected now I'll just go here assign then I'll just go here uh, frame then I'll just go output station so here the minimum number station here you have to provide 13 right and simply apply okay just see here everywhere we're seeing 13 and after that we'll just go for analysis so our analysis have completed right so after uh, completing our analysis I'll just go here file then I'll just go export at ETAPS table to access so I'll just click that on and that on okay i'll just click that on and that on and i'll right click on here modify and from here for load actually uh, i will use the two load now okay i'll just use the two load uh, to save our time okay to save our time i'll just use the two load and everything will be default after that i'll simply click uh, okay and then click here okay and here you can change your unit okay so I'm actually I'll create more video on that tutorial series so then I'll just show you about that okay so and here I'll save our file so I'll save our that file in desktop here uh, I can save here okay okay it's, it's etaps and the file access file mdb then save And wait for some time till it's been generating so it's have generated now what I'll do I'll just save our ETAPS and I'll just close our ETAPS and after that here I have uh, selected our file so this is our that file ETAPS file okay just now I have selected and I have uh, I mean I have saved that file here so I will just open now our estate RCDC software And here I'll just give a project name I'll, I'll give a client name and SOC is called civil engineering and from here I'll select a code no problem so from here I'll just go that folder from desktop here is our file and I'll, sorry uh, before that I have to do something I've just forgotten I have to open that file okay and also I'll create a video on it okay so here I'll just click enable content and from here file save save that file as 
database 2022-2003 uh, version we have to select that okay then click at save as and go to that folder what you can save anywhere so i'm just selecting that folder and etaps okay demo di and modify then save enable that and simply close that okay so here a modify file have created now open that and in this time it will work so just give her anything and select any code from here and from here I'll just select that on okay now it's okay and so here beam okay so here uh, i have selected beam now for which floor you want to design i want to design for every floor no problem so just simply click here create new project and see what happened now see it's working perfectly right yeah now it's working perfectly so see this is the all data from my etap so i will just create a full tutorial series if you want so if you want uh, please uh, comment me below and after completing that if is it okay please leave a thanks message otherwise if if you have any further problem just uh, let me know i'll try to create a new way okay so thank you and obviously subscribe to our channel and like our video because your subscription like and comment inspires for the next work and uh, our um, i just work for you so you should do that so thank you thank you very much